WFNN. Headline News Update. Okay, folks, this is Larry Pesavento setting in for Tom O'Brien to give you the afternoon update. Uh, stocks opened uh, slightly lower this evening or early in the evening. Uh, Lex, early in the morning, I mean, <laughs> around 2 o'clock New York time. They were lower, sharply lower, going into 4 a.m. New York time. And then the market started to move around. And then when the CPI number came out, they exploded to the upside, going from minus 250 in the Dow Jones to up 250 in the Dow Jones, and then down 250 in the Dow Jones to be closing up on the day. So it had a little bit for everybody. All the indices uh, closed higher, than, led by the NASDAQ. That was the leader of the pack today. The one market that was still struggling all day, of course, was the Treasury bond market, folks. But that's no news because it's been struggling for the last two and a half years when we topped up at 174 in the Treasury bonds. And now we're trading at 126, down more than 40 percent yeah, from that level. And remember, that's when they were trying to tell us there was negative interest rates when it was 170. Never did quite believe that story. Another market to pay close attention to, folks, if you're in the financial uh, venue and you're interested in looking at the long side of gold, we're coming into a really strong support zone in gold at 1840. We hit 1852 today, which is pretty close, but we still think we've got a chance to get down to that 1840 level, and that should hold. But uh, if it doesn't, that means you'll, you'll be out of it at 1820, looking for another place to go along, because you don't want to try to catch a falling knife if that is what it turns out to be. You do not want to do that. Remember, folks, in the words of Roy Longstreet, the first mistake teaches, the second mistake kills. So the first mistake is you bought it at the wrong time, but the second mistake is, guess what? You were smart enough to get out of it, and you didn't make that second mistake. So remember, folks, that second mistake kills, and that's the one that usually hurts you the most. So do one thing, folks. Come back and visit us tomorrow, either in the Tiger Den or on radio, TV. We're everywhere, globally. We're just the absolute great place to work and meet the wonderful people here at the Tiger Den and Tiger Financial News. So if you get a chance, stop in and visit us. So we'll see you all on the flip side tomorrow. May God bless. Sharpening your